America is known as a melting pot. One of the biggest ingredients in that pot is the Irish culture. It is the second most recorded ancestral group in America. Many Irish Americans have influenced American culture. Henry Ford, Walt Disney, Tom Clancy, Conan O'Brien, Ed Sullivan, John Kennedy, Andrew Jackson, Tom Brady, Jack Dempsey, John Elway, John McEnroe, and Billy the Kid all have Irish blood. Technically, there are more Irish in America than in Ireland. 22 presidents have Irish ancestry. Andrew Jackson and JFK, however, have the strongest documented Irish origins. When the Irish first immigrated to America after the potato famine, they were poorly regarded. Their position in America was one of shame and poverty. They arrived at a time of need in America. The country was growing and needed men to do the heavy work of building bridges, canals, and railroads. Irish women also worked as chambermaids, cooks, and servants to children. Americans viewed this type of work as only being fit for servants. Let Negroes be servants, and if not Negroes, let Irishmen fill their place, became a popular sentiment. The annual celebration of St. Patrick's Day may be the most widely recognized symbol of the Irish presence in America. In cities throughout the United States, this traditional Irish religious holiday becomes a, an opportunity to celebrate all things Irish. Since the arrival of nearly two million Irish immigrants in the 1840s, the urban Irish cop and firefighter have become virtual icons of American popular culture. In many large cities, the police and the fire departments have been dominated by the Irish for over a hundred years. Even after the ethnic Irish residential populations in these cities dwindled to small minorities.